first race of 2019 today, doing the Olympic Park 10k with a run through crew. Um, really great events, these are sort of uh, really regular. Most weekends there's a run through event on in London, which is really good. Uh, it's only a 10k, but I'm going to put everything into it today. Blood sugars are ticking along. Good there, 7.2 and flat. Um, I'll be eating an energy bar shortly just before I start. It's only a 10k, so I'm hoping not to need to take fuel on as I'm running today. Um, we just see how it goes, really. It should be quite a good event. Nice and busy. Plenty of people around. So yeah, we'll uh, give it a go, see how we get on. First race of 2019 done, done 10k there, uh, went really well, done it in just under 46 minutes, it was about 45, 46, something like that, I did it in, which is good. Blood sugars before I started was 7.2, and they finished on a nice flat 8.9, so from a diabetes point of view, don't go better than that, that's as good as a 10k is going to get from that point of view, that was really good. First medal of 2019, there'll be plenty more of these this year, I'm sure. Um, doing many races as I can leading into the London Marathon just to get this race practice to see how diabetes is going to behave. A bit of adrenaline on race day, a bit of nerves, stuff like that. It all affects blood sugars, so the more I can practice that, the better chance I've got in, in April when I get them to start playing for London. Um, State's gone really well though, really pleased with that. Um, I've got the winter 10k in February, on the 2nd of February. Last year I did that in 45 minutes, 2 seconds. So obviously the goal this year is to beat that, just get a sub 45 10k. Um, I don't really think I'm ever going to be much quicker than that on a 10k to be fair, but you never know. That's the plan anyway, so I'm going to train hard for that distance now. I've got sort of three weeks until that race, so I just put plenty of speed work in. Um, that hopefully will stand me in good step for putting in a PB in London. Fingers crossed anyway, that's the plan.